welcome to my channel crochet skills in today's video i will show you how to crochet this beautiful car uh, booty there are appliques on it these are the lights so let's start working on that kind of booty okay so here's my sole this is 6.5 inches sole and uh, you can check in uh, my playlist crochet booties in this you will definitely easily uh, find out the pattern of this sole so let's start working on the body of the booty okay so as you can see these are the increasing stitches of the uh, booty so i will count it back one two three four five six seven and eight into this eighth let's count it again two four six and eight insert the hook into this eighth one and pull it through this loop chain one just to create the height work a back post double crochet all the way around a back post double crochet in every stitch one back post double crochet i need to work with white yarn i will just work one back post double crochet in every stitch just work one back post double crochet all the way around and we will just make this row by making one back post double crochet every stitch okay so my row is completed one back post double crochet each stitch just insert the hook into this very first stitch draw this blue yarn and pull it through these two loops together pull this uh, tightly make chain two one and two work one half double crochet into every stitch just insert the hook and work a half double crochet with this uh, blue yarn make one half double crochet each stitch all around and make a slip stitch here okay so row two is also completed this is my last single crochet insert the hook into the very first half double crochet and make a slip stitch with this white yarn okay make chain one with white yarn make chain one go into this second stitch work a slip stitch go into the next stitch and work a slip stitch go into the next and make a slip stitch so this is how without cutting this blue yarn i will make one slip stitch into every stitch and make a slip stitch into this first slip okay so uh, we are here as you can see in this row in this slip stitch row here so now i will work in the next row which also has one half double crochet into every stitch so just continue working how to make it this is the okay so this is my first stitch make chain two okay so we will do one half double crochet in every stitch into the same round where we have worked slip stitches right now so work one half double crochet around every stitch yarn over go into the same stitch work a half double crochet yarn over go into the next work a half double crochet so i will work one half double crochet each stitch and make a slip stitch here okay so my round four is also completed now what we are going to do is we will count stitches 31 2 4 6 8 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30 and 31. So here we have worked our, that only means that we have uh, started with 6, 8 stitches before the slip stitch. So we will do the same thing from this side and make a, put a stitch marker here. So I would just like to place a stitch marker in this place okay so let's start working on decreases of uh, this first round okay make chain one not counted as a first double crochet work up back post decreasing double crochet by making it in back post okay work one back post double crochet work one back post decrease and one back post double crochet alternatively so i will do the same thing till i've uh, reached here after at uh, 31st uh, stitch okay so i'm done with my decreases so as you can see it's uh, turns into backwards like this so now in all the uh, next stitches i will work one single crochet 
each stitch just work one single crochet each stitch all the way around here and make a slip stitch into this first decrease okay so this round is also completed now i'll start working on the next round which is one two three four fifth and sixth round so make chain two just to uh, create the height and work a decreasing double crochet in this first two stitch work another decreasing double crochet so now we will work in only decreases in all these first stitches which we have worked in back post in the previous round so work the same way only work decreases so i'll show you how many decreases i have one two three now i'm working on the fourth one again fifth one because now we are decreasing every single every next stitch okay again one two three four five this is the sixth one next needs to be seventh then eighth this is the ninth decrease I have one stitch left so I will work a double crochet here okay make one single crochet in each of the next stitches and make a slip stitch here okay so make another round of decreasing chain one again work go into this stitch pull up a loop pull it through two yarn over go into the next pull up a loop pull it through two pull it through all the loops together this is my one two three four five six and seventh round so again i will work only in decreases from the front okay so make just decreases this is my second one this is third okay so work another decreasing double crochet yarn over go into the stitch pull up a loop pull it through to yarn over go into the next pull up a loop pull it through to pull it through all the loops together work one last decrease here so now i have into the front where we have 31 stitches now i have one two three four and only five stitches work one single crochet into every next stitch and just insert the hook and work a single crochet all the way around and make a slip stitch into this first decrease okay so let's make it last time make decreases okay i will show you in a bit detail so this is how now my booty is looking perfectly all right the same like this it's properly in shape so i will make one more decreasing round just work chain two or one it's totally up to you because it's not counted as a first stitch so make a decrease decreasing double crochet go into the next work another decreasing double crochet go into the next work up double crochet work one single crochet in each of the next stitches and make a slip stitch here okay so round eight is also completed now round nine and ten would be the same make chain one go into the first stitch work a single crochet go into the next work a single crochet go into the next stitch also and work up single crochet one single crochet around every stitch so i will make two rounds of these one single crochet each stitch and uh, this is how my booty will be completed and then we will start working on these appliques on the top and on these both sides okay so my uh, last round is also completed all the 10 rounds are completed now i will make this uh, white edging on the top so attach it on any stitch insert the hook pull it through two sorry pull it through this um, stitch 
work a single crochet go into the next stitch work a single crochet go into the next work a single crochet go into the next stitch and work a single crochet so i will work all the stitches uh, one single crochet each stitch and make a slip stitch into this first stitch so this is how i will just complete my this round and then we will work on the pleaks okay so i hope you can see that my basic booty is completed and now i will just decorate it uh, with these two appliques and i will show you how to make these lights on the top so uh, let's complete it okay so let's start by making these two front lights these two so how to make it with this yarn i will just make chain make a slip knot chain three into this third chain from the hook work eight half double crochets just make eight half double crochets one two three four five six seven and eight make a slip stitch cut the yarn make two like this and place it in front okay so make this strand this make chain eight go into the second chain from the hook work seven single crochets make chain one and work seven single crochets so make chain one seven single crochets so three rows similar like this so i will make these and i will place it in the in this side i will just place it here i will make that kind of two wheels make a magic circle and uh, seven half double crochets here then make these white marks on it make two wheels and sew it just here on this downside okay and here i will make this green part and to these wheels what i'm going to do is i will make uh, six single crochets of this yellow yarn and make one single crochet uh, in black yarn for this i will make eight half double crochets in the center and one single crochet each stitch. so this is how it will look so now i will show you how to make this green um tractor so okay take the green yarn make a slip knot chain seven one two three four five six and seven chain 7 go into the second chain from the hook work one single crochet each stitch 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 make chain 1 and turn work one single crochet each stitch 1 2 3 four five and six chain one done work one single crochet one in the next two one in the next three one in the next four leave these two chain one done one single crochet each of the next four stitches one two three and four chain one turn in this first stitch work a single crochet in this second work another single crochet in this third work another single crochet chain one turn one single crochet each stitch one two and three so this is how my green tractor will look i will place it i will see all these parts on it and then i will show you the end product okay so this is how they are looking from this side from this side it's like that and 
to these sides i have this red tractor so this i have embroidered this one two three on it so i hope you have liked it please don't forget to subscribe my channel like and share my video for any query you can ask me in comment thank you for watching thank you so much